welcome back to this week I've got another side hustle update for you from August so let's get started so the first one is premium bonds uh, I think I won last month as well can't remember and um, but I won again this month which is great um, with my premium bonds now for like a few years I might start adding some more to that going forward so yeah, premium bonds for August, I won £75, which is really good. Uh, that just gets reinvested back into my account. Um, obviously, if you've maxed out the account, then they just transfer the money to your like, current account, because you can't add any more to it when it's maxed out. Um, so yeah, I've been using premium bonds for about, well, since I was like 16, I think it was, my dad set me up my account. So yeah, over 10 years, um, my parents use prune bonds, my sister and brother do, my partner's family do. Um, there's been a few big wins in the family, um, not like a million pounds or anything like that, um, but yeah, a few big wins over the years. Um, so that's always really encouraging to keep my money there. But you can always just take it out, it takes like, like three days to withdraw. Um, so it's not instant access, you know, three days to withdraw the money. So yeah, that's premium bonds for August. Next we have Vinted. Uh, this is a mix of reselling and selling my own items. And for August it was £89.50. Um, so that's quite good for August. And uh, it's summer holidays so actually. Yes, it's good for August, but it's actually really quiet in August. Um, people are too busy on holiday going out looking for their kids to be on Vinted. So now it's a time we will pick up more for Christmas and also for that winter wear as well. Everyone's looking for coats on there. It's a really good time to put things on Vinted if it is like winter wear. So yeah, next one we have took a again. I'm not sure, I think this is pending from like weeks ago. Maybe just from some clothes I bought, maybe I'm not too sure. Um, but I saw a little bit of money in there, so I thought I'd cash it out anyway instead of letting it build up. Um, but yeah, it's only like £2.26. Um, so yeah, I'm not sure. I really can't remember if I even got top cash back last month because it's not like a monthly thing that you get. And how much you use the platform, and um, it does take quite a long time to get that back from companies. Next, we have Prolific, which is a survey site which I've been using for over two years now. I haven't been using this much in August, and September I've not used it at all. You know, I've been on holiday, just not had the time really to use it. So, September's one will be interesting. <laughs> Um, so for August, it received £26.77, which is still fine. Yeah, that'll pay like our phone bills, that'll pay like one of our water bills. So I'm so happy with that. Next, we have Shop and Scan, which is a new thing I started this year. I've been on their waiting list for about four years. <laughs> That's how crazy, like, busy it is. Um, but it's like a little like device thing so when you get your groceries each week from like Tesco or whatever you just scan them so you scan this book you scan everything you've bought you let them know what offers each item was um, it doesn't take that long to do um, so you do it every week them, and then you earn points and then you can cash those points in for gift cards like H&M, uh, other stores where there, you know, New Look, you know, all different gift cards, Amazon voucher maybe if you can do. Um, so I started this maybe, it works out about 10 that you would get, but I sort of save it up and then cash it out. This is my second cash out. Uh, I think I've already had a £20 gift card back in like May I think it was. Um, this one is a £30 gift card 
I'm not sure what I'm gonna cash it out as yet. It might just be like an Amazon card, just so I can then just have some Amazon credits um, ready for Christmas. Or maybe if I find like an HM that I like, I'll use that. But they'll post you the gift card in the post, which is what was a bit unusual when that first happened. Uh, the first one was a £20 Next gift card. Um, and I bought, I bought, I bought like a top for my holiday or something like that. So yeah, I'm not sure I'm going to buy this gift card. Um, but I do need a new pair of trainers. So there is Adidas and Nike gift card I might to put towards a pair of trainers. So they're quite expensive anyway. I don't tend to go on offer that much. Um, so yeah, shop and scan. You can sign up to it. There's other companies that do this as well. They just want to know what you're buying each week, how much it is. They, they want the receipt as well. It literally takes me like 10 minutes every Saturday evening to do it. Just when my shop arrives, I quickly scan it all, go to the computer, upload it, upload the receipt, and then also anything I buy during the week. If I do buy anything, I'll then just scan and upload it as well. Um, but mostly I like to just sort of stick to Tesco, um, unless I want to add milk or anything like that, I can then pop out and get it. And uh, see so yeah, that is shop and scan. I hope that explains it a bit better. Uh, and the total for August side hustles is. £226.53. Obviously, that includes the gift card, which isn't obviously cash. Uh, and then, obviously, the 75 premium bonds is reinvested. So, I actually haven't got that cash in my account that I use because that's just back in the premium bonds account. So, that's fine. So, yeah, it's a, a lot less of what's in my account. But it's just a total overall of what I've been doing in August, holidays, and stuff like that. Um, so yeah, £226.53, uh, I'm sure September, I'm away for like 11 nights in September on a cruise, so I'm sure I'm not going to show it to show, but I'll show it anyway, it might just be like a 5 minute video for September maybe. Um, but yeah, that is the total for the August side hustles. in the comments below if you do any side hustles any surveys or any apps that you find that are really good and that are like easy to do and you actually get like an income from them it'd be great to know i'm happy to like test any future ones out to see and um, but for the moment these ones are really working for me and then don't take up too much time because uh, i know there's like survey apps where you earn like one p and it's just yeah that's really time consuming Unless I'm like waiting in a queue or waiting for a bus or waiting for something and then I can just quickly do a survey. Um, but that's really rare. I have that time. Um, especially with now a two year old. Um, so yeah, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe. Um, my channel is quite like lifestyle centred. Um, a mixture of like vintage and charity shop hauls. Uh, now I'm doing my side hustles, my grocery shop for the week, um, I've got a video coming of the cruise I've just been on and also my daughter's second birthday, um, what I bought for it and how I prepped for it and how much everything cost. So yeah, lots of different videos from my channel. So yeah, I hope you like this video and thank you for watching and I'll see you in my next video.